ladies. Good morning. Happy Friday. Come on to the table. I am here and ready to talk. Um, it's been a long week, so I am looking forward to the weekend. Um, hoping all of you are too. And today's come to the table discussion question is, who is in your social circle and who are you inviting? And the reason why that's kind of been on my mind is that, um, as I said, I took the day off social media yesterday. Like, I, it wasn't a 100% day because it just wasn't. Um, people DM'd me some questions and I had to um, get back with them. So while I was on there, I looked to see how things were going in the group. Caught a post or two, but overall, um, I just wasn't engaged. I didn't really spend too much time on there. And it was so good just having a break from all the noise and having a break from all the opinions and just... Spending time with the Lord and just chilling outside of social media. So, um, anyway, at any rate, um, one of the conversations I had yesterday with um, a different set of people was that, oh, well, um, you know, change comes from our relationships. As ch- as uh, Christians, who we involve, like, how we relate to people is through our relationships. So, I'm like, bet, that makes sense. But then that made me think, though, is like if your social circle only includes people who look like you, think like you, act like you, are you really being the light that you say you're going to be, um, what God called us to be? I don't have a bunch of Bible verses like I usually do. Um, you guys can easily Google it or just flip through what you know to look for. But what the Lord brought to my mind this morning was actually Luke chapter 14. Verse 12 through 14. Then he, that's Jesus, then he also said to him who invited him, When you have a dinner or a supper, do not ask your friends, your brothers, your relatives, nor rich neighbors, lest they also invite you back and you be repaid. When you, but, but ugh, can't talk, sorry y'all. But when you give a feast, invite the poor, the maimed, the lame, the blind, and you will be blessed, because they cannot repay you. For you should be repaid at the resurrection, resurrection of the just. Um, now, yes, that passes. Um, Jesus is talking more about generosity. Like, who, like kind of what Shannon was talking about yesterday. Who's my neighbor? Who is the poor and needy? But um, it's easy to actually apply that to just the way Jesus lived his life. You know, um, they called him a wine, bo- wine biber and a drunkard and said he sat and ate with sinners. So he didn't just sit with people who looked like him um, and thought like he did. Like he, that was his ministry was through relationships and spending time with other people. So if you are really about the change, I see a lot of people advocating for saying, you know, why do white people hate me? Why are black people so angry? Or even outside of race, when you were just questioning, you know, people who have tattoos, or you're questioning people who've had abortions or even questioning gay people. Like, we are able to relate to people by spending time with them and not just judging them. And it's easy to say, you know, Jesus can fix the world, but are you bringing Jesus to the world? And are you just relying too much on a Sunday sermon and just saying, you know, y'all come to church with me and that's how you'll hear the word. Hear the word. But some people have had so much church hurt, they're not going inside that door. So any Jesus they see is going to come from you. So that's just my question of the to today, young ladies, is who is in your social circle who do you invite to hang out with you? Um, are you happy with how your social circle looks? Do you um, actively engage with other people who don't look like you? And if you don't, why not? And if you um, do, just you know, tell us a story about how that came to be. Because I think my circle is pretty diverse, but it definitely could always be improved. So let's talk about it, ladies. Come to the table. Let's talk. Your social circle. Let's talk about it. Y'all have a good weekend. Um, Drop your comments. Drop your videos. If you upload your own separate posts, please hashtag come to the table.